have a game for you. It's called Teen Moments. It's called Teen Moments, and it's sort of about your teen life. Oh, God. We're going to talk about your teen life. Oh, my God. I'm still, like, recovering from my teen life. Well, you're not far off. Exactly. That's what I mean. <laughs> Most awkward teen moment. Ooh. Uh, Did you go through an awkward phase? I never really went, no. Were you I always this strappingly good looking? Oh, always. Gosh. Always just this born dude. born this good looking? <laughs> I was, actually. My mom was having to fight off cougars when I was born. It was really weird, All actually. The yeah, kind of creepy. Most awkward team moment. Uh, I got pantsed at my own birthday party uh, in front of a jacuzzi full of people from my best friend. You got what? Pants. You What's know, that? You don't know pants? <laughs> no. Let me explain this because it's not embarrassing Let's enough already. You even more. I was in a pool with a swimsuit. My best friend came up from behind me and made me no longer be wearing a swimsuit. Wow. Yeah. And how was the response? I, I pulled the shorts back up and then dove in the pool so quickly to beat the crap out of him that I don't remember what the response was. I didn't see it personally. Maybe there was a round of applause. You never know. And my Spanish teacher dropped down like the big screen and put all my YouTube videos up. I mean, there's one where I'm literally wearing my sister's t-shirt, <laughs> like lip syncing to Spice Girls. And then like my friend walks in Actually, and busts I saw me. that one. Really? Yeah. Great. What Brand. song was it? It's called Wannabe. How's it go? What are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> I farted in front of my girlfriend's, in front of one of my girlfriends by accident one time. Uh, I don't know if she How heard it. How did it happen? I was lying on the ground and like, <laughs> like this, my legs were up and like, it was just a bunch of us. Like we were hanging out like teenagers and, and like I was sitting up and I farted a little bit and like I sat like all the way up and looked around and I don't think anyone noticed or they didn't they say anything. They pretended they didn't notice. She fully told all of her I think, friends. I think so, I think so. I think you that's why we broke that. up actually. I went to an all girls school for 11 years. I did not sit in a class with boys until I was 16. So I did not realize that women alter their behavior when in front of guys. I, I never wore makeup. And so what do you prefer? Being able to be a slob and have no guys around? <laughs> that, unfortunately, it, it, surprisingly, it gets old. Um, but I would say my most awkward moment was sitting in a classroom with boys for the first time because I was 16. It was wow. on the older end, yeah. Worst lie, you told your parents when you were a teen. Oof. Worst lie, you told your parents when you were a teen. Can you do it in English? Worst, worst lie you told your parents right. when you were a teen, darling. D darling. <laughs> I'm gonna keep that between me and my parents because it was bad enough the first time. Do they know? Oh yeah. Since the age of eight, I've wanted to be American. So I lied to my school and I told them I was American. One of the teachers knew my, my mother and was like, I'm not American. <laughs> I would have my mom drop me off at the library every day after sure school so I could do my homework. Yeah. Um, I believe you. Started junior year. Are you year lying to me like, now? That little. <laughs> <laughs> my mom has the better story with her, with my grandmother. She skipped school, went out for a commercial, got the commercial. It was for skydiving. She forged her mom's signature, and her mom found out when she saw the commercial on television of her daughter skydiving. Did you have any bad driving incidents as a teen? I actually didn't get a car until I was 19. A driver's license? A driver's license, yeah. Why? I drove 300 miles to the smallest town with the smallest DMV so that I could pass the test without fail. <laughs> And I got, I think I made 15 errors in the first five Are minutes. Are you serious? They were like, but just turn around, of... turn around, don't kill us and take us back to the it DMV. You failed. I was driving in Greece. They drive on the right side, so your idea, the right side of the road. <laughs> yes. My idea, the wrong side of the road. And I suddenly was like, oh my God, this guy's coming down the wrong side of the road. What an idiot. <laughs> Honk, what an idiot goes like this. Going, oh. And then realized that I'd been doing it for about five miles up this like, and people were just like swerving. Oh, my, my friends and I were being really stupid. I was in the back. And there's another friend in the front and then another friend in the back. He was driving really, really fast and we were just like off-roading, you know, going crazy. He came up on this turn really tight and couldn't correct it and we went up this thing and then <laughs> completely flipped over. No! Yeah, no, we flipped over and there was a cup. I remember a cup right in the middle of the cup holders. And as we were turning over, I could see the liquid come out in like slow motion no and, and hit, hit the roof. Yeah, and my friend peed right afterwards. <laughs> yeah, I think it scared Involuntarily? him. The, the driver, yeah, I think so. Okay, worst teen haircut. Worst teen haircut. Because you're very haircut. gifted in that department. Oh, God. I don't know if I want to admit this. Uh -huh. I feel like none of you on this set have ever had a bad hair day in your life. Um, I have cut my hair twice in my life, and both were mistakes. <laughs> Did you cry? Two times? Oh, yeah. yeah. It was a loss of the f a family member. <laughs> That's big. You never want to lose like three pounds from cutting your hair. That's never <laughs> a good sign. No. I, I dyed my hair. Uh, Peroxide white and then shaved it. Another one of your cast members did the same. No way. But, but I won't tell one? you who. Which one? She really did? Yeah. It's crazy. Teen celeb crush. 
Does, it, does that mean they have to be a teenager still? Because that's kind of creepy, right? Mm -hmm. Oh, Kira Knightley. Right. Have that you met Kira Knightley? Never met Kira Knightley, no. <laughs> oh god, oh god, oh god. <laughs> um, Selena Gomez is pretty cute. Jennifer Aniston, like crazy. Have you right? met her? No. Oh what is God, going on? I None of the cast out. today that I've asked has met their crush. Emma Watson. Have no. you met her? No. Uh, I did. I did meet her one time, yeah. Did you tell her you had a crush on her? I don't think so. You I think should. I was a little flustered. The one song that makes you think of your teen years. Uh, I actually have it tattooed on my arm. It's, uh, it's this note right here. <gasps> it's it's the first note of a Blink-182 song. How's it go? Sorry, I had to sing the intro to the guitar. <laughs> Please, Mom, you ground me all the time. I know that I was right all along, and I'm hoping... Yeah, it's That's right. good. It's you sound like them. And the one song that makes you think of your teen years. Uh, Dave Matthews Band. Nice. Uh, any Dave Matthews song. Can't Stop by Red Hot Chili Peppers. Well, you like, connected. just the band in general, I like, like loved when I was a, a teenager and playing Have drums. Have you met and... them? No. If you could meet Jennifer Aniston or the Red Hot Chili Peppers, who would you choose? Um, I gotta go Jennifer Aniston. <laughs> yes, yeah. <laughs> I mean, duh. Is that who you're eyeing in there? I guess. Go ahead. I'll leave you alone. Have fun. Is this still on? Whoa, forgot about that camera. I'm just gonna, I'm gonna go. What reminds me of being a teenager? God, that's so tough. I'd say... I thought that was a song. I thought you just broke into song there. <laughs> Wait, should we go out with that? God, that's so tough. God, being a teen is so tough. We're onto something. We're yeah. just like connected that ESP, way. Baby. You and I. Mm -hmm. All the way. Mm -hmm.